So I put together an easy TRX circuit. So we're going to start off with low rows, just leaning back. To make this a little more difficult or challenging, you can bring your feet a little closer to where it's hooked. Kind of look up where it's attached so you keep your neck relaxed. We should feel this in the lats, kind of that lower part of the shoulder blade without having any tension in the shoulder joint. <clears throat> We'll hit about 10 reps of each of these, and then we'll lean back and do a little lean back squat. We should just feel the thighs with this one. Shouldn't feel anything any, as far as tightness in the back or the hip or in the knee joint. Should be all in the quads. Kind of hang back with your arms so you get a little stretch in it as well. We'll move into the bicep curl. You're gonna think about your elbows kind of staying up and pointing straight ahead. Neck still going to stay relaxed. We're going to feel this in your biceps, right in the front side of the arm. Still the neck and the shoulder should be nice and relaxed. Then we can move into a split squat. You can use the TRX for a little balance and support and a little assistance in standing. You're going to think about feeling this all in the front quad, so the front part of the thigh, while still keeping the neck relaxed, the shoulders relaxed. Shouldn't feel anything in the knee joint or in the low back. And then we'll flip around and as soon as I get these straps fixed, takes me a minute. I'm not going to edit the video, sorry. <laughs> and then you can do a tricep press. Back and forth, should feel this in the back of the arms. Shouldn't have any pressure or pain in the elbow joint. Neck should be relaxed. Definitely shouldn't feel any shoulder joint as well. And then we can end the circuit, walking out and just reaching up and down using the straps as a little bit of assistance to reach overhead and get a nice stretch. Do about five of these and then we can go up and let the arms come down by the side. Just getting a little staggered stance back and forth. Should just feel an easy stretch with this. Should not have any pain. This is just going to help the shoulders going to go through a range of motion, work on the shoulder mobility and then we can flip back and just lean back into the hips. Should feel a nice stretch in our low back, in our hips, and behind the shoulders. Just breathe easy in this position. And then all we're gonna do is kinda go side to side. You can kinda turn the body. It just depends on where you need the stretch and how it feels. And so that's one circuit, and let's shoot for three total rounds. <clears throat> 